We've been doing it here for the securities returns and the market returns now. What all this is leading us up to is doing what's known as a simple linear regression. And we're doing it by hand, you and I. Now, this is the simple linear regression equation here. And we're trying to define in this simple linear regression the returns of security I. And simple linear regression will tell you that that's going to be equal to alpha plus beta times the return of the market. And in this case, we don't know what alpha is. We haven't, there's no direct, you know, statistical way of determining this. It's a derivative kind of process. But we do know what the mean return, what the expected return was for the security. It was 4.33. And we know what the expected mean return is for the market. It was 3.67. And we know the beta statistic between the security and the market. That's 0.76. And so filling that in now, we know everything but alpha. And if you solve for alpha, that turns out to be 4.33 minus 0.76 times 3.67. And that's going to give us an alpha of 1.708, positive. Now, given that, that gives us, and that gets us to the final regression equation which is this right here, which says that the return of the security, what we think the re return of the security is now, is going to be 1.7808, which is alpha, plus the beta of the security times whatever we think the market return is going to be. This little equation right here in investments now is known as the characteristic line. And the characteristic line is this little simple linear regression that we run, typically to come up with beta, but it also is a way of defining an, ex an expected return for the security. Remember an earlier statistic that we calculated with this, these two distributions? We found that the R squared, the coefficient of determination, was 0.67 or 67%. And again, what that means now is that 67% of the variation in the return of the security is explained by variation in the return of the market. That other 33%, we don't know what that is. And we might add other factors, other elements, maybe do a, a multiple regression, but we don't, at this point, we don't know what that is. We'd have to go out and, and investigate. But this is a simple linear regression by hand that we've done. And this is how you come down with the regression equation, what's called the characteristic line for a security, for a company. And again, known as the characteristic line.